also. <gasps> wait, 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 don't, don't. Uh, I forgot my eye primer. I need to brand, brand. <sighs> oh, oh. <gasps> hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And today I have some very exciting products to try out with you. I've got the Fenty Beauty Summer Collection right here. Um, so obviously I have the eyeshadow palette and um, I got one of the uh, lip gloss trio I think. I also got the eye primer and the new eyeliner from Fenty Beauty. I've already tried some of these things out like the eye primer and the eyeliner because I just want to give you guys uh, my initial thoughts and reviews on how these uh, wears throughout the day. I already have my base makeup done and I'm going to do my eyes and my lips in front of you guys. Okay, so this is the palette. So this is called Moroccan Spice eyeshadow palette. I've seen on the Fenty Beauty Instagram that they have done quite a few makeup looks with this and it's so pretty. So if you guys don't know, Fenty Beauty came out with um, their first eyeshadow palette earlier and it's all with like glitter and shimmer shades, but this one got a really cool print here. I love it. They actually included more finishes of eyeshadows like mattes, shimmers, and maybe glitters. So I haven't used any of these. Oh, what? This is the palette. How beautiful is it? I'm just having such a chill day and it's really rainy and gloomy outside and I'm not really going anywhere so I think I'm gonna do a, more of a natural look out of this. I forgot my eye primer so um, for their new eye primer I'm actually really excited because this is a big bottle for like eye primer. It's called the Pro Filter Amplifying Eye Primer. It's in the shade Invisi Pink so I don't know if they'll come out more shades. This eye primer is on the thicker side right off the bat. You can tell that uh, this primer has a really uh, sticky feeling to it. I've worn this primer yesterday and it does help my eyeshadow stay for a really long time given that um, it's really hot and humid out there and it's constantly raining every day so I would say this eye primer is legit. Putting this, come and get it, all over my crease. Ooh, that's so pigmented. Oh shoot. <laughs> Oh my god, this, that's a lot. <laughs> I'm gonna say that eye primer really helps um, the eyeshadow to stick because you can just feel it like on your eye, it's, it's the eyeshadow's just like, like stuck. I'm just gonna need to blend this really well. I think it would be easier if, if you just put like a skin colored eyeshadow all over your lids so that um, the eye primer doesn't grab these pigmented eyeshadow too much because now it's kind of doing that and my eyes are pretty uneven so mm -hmm. okay so I'm really digging this gold shade called Casablanca it's this one right here and it's a really really pretty gold I'm just gonna use my fingers so I'm just gonna put it like on the inner oh inner parts of my lids this shade is more like more glittery than I expected it to be so the gold that you see here is like it's it's the glitter that's the gold and because I am doing a simple eye makeup today I'm just gonna finish it up with a darker shade I actually really want to use this grayish charcoal shade it's called shisha smoke I'm just gonna use this tiny tiny brush This gray actually has like a really cool blue tint to it, so if you really blend it out, it's more like a grayish blue. As you can see, the edges are a bit harder to blend. I don't know if it's because of the primer, because the primer grabs the product so firmly. So I'm just gonna go in with my crease brush and just blend it out. This look is a bit smokier than I anticipated, but... I really like this. I like that uh, Shisha Smoke isn't as pigmented as 
as I um, expected because if it were, it would be pretty hard for me to work with. This uh, Shisha Smoke shade, it, you can build it up for sure, so it gives you more like flexibility in terms of that. I'm also gonna take it under my eyes. And then I'm taking their eyeliner. What's their eyeliner called? I just dropped my eyeliner. Whoa, okay, so some of the product inside got onto my wooden floor. And for a, it's just for a second, I went in for my uh, tissue paper to wipe it out, but then it's stuck. I wore this eyeliner yesterday and it is pretty long wearing and you can tell that it has a grip to it. Like you can actually feel it um, staying there, so... So my overall impression for this eyeliner is that um, it's really black, it's really pigmented, and it stays for a really, really long time, even on oily eyelids like me. If you are finding a really oil-proof, long-wearing black eyeliner, you can definitely give this a try. Um, but I will say that because it's so pigmented, if you make one mistake, it's going to be really hard to remove it. But it's not hard to use at all. My eye makeup looks like this. Okay, so I'm gonna curl my lashes and put some mascara on off camera. Then we'll come back to you with Z lips. So now I have my lashes on and we're moving on with the lips. So I got the uh, Iridescent Lip Luminizer Trio. They have, um, I believe they have six shades in total. So I got the ones with a green, the blue, and the pink. And I'm gonna swatch them on my arm for you because I don't. I'm not really sure which one I want. So first off, it's this really pretty pinkish shade. Well, I have to do this. Okay, so um, this is the shade Vey Cray. It's the pretty pink. This has like really tiny gold glitters in it with a pink undertone. So it's really pretty and like great for every day, I would say. And then they have this really pretty iridescent blue. This shade is the reason why I got this trio instead of the other one because this is called Mermaid Thighs. I absolutely die for that name. I can't. If you don't know me, I love mermaids. I believe in mermaids 100%. There are mermaids out there. This is Mermaid Thighs. So pretty. I don't know how it would look on the lips though. And the last shade, it's this um, iridescent green. Oh, it has like a gold and purple shift to it. It's called snakeskin and again, I love snakes so this trio is perfect for me. God, I have to turn my wrist like that. <laughs> so um, eh, this is snakeskin. Look how reflective these three are. Okay, I think I should just go there and go with mermaid thighs because that shade is so pretty. This is my bare lips. I'm just gonna go in with this because I just want to see its true colors on my lips. <sighs> it's so blue. Wow. This shade. Oh, it's, let me zoom in. Ooh, this blue is pretty. If you don't dare to have like a really solid, bold blue lip, then this lip gloss, it's definitely for you to try out. It's so pretty. But the thing is that I don't think it goes with my eyes and um, I'm having dinner with my boyfriend's parents tonight, so <laughs> wipe this off. Okay, so the only reasonable color to wear for me today is the pink shade Vaycre. So this color initially it looks like your everyday pink lip gloss but then when the light hits all the gold glitters on your lips will like just reflect the light and it's got it's so pretty. It's not sticky at all, it's not thick, it doesn't really slip and slide much which I like and it feels comfortable on the lips. 
doesn't have any smell to it also my overall impression for the Fenty Beauty summer collection first off I really really like the eyeshadow palette I think it's definitely more wearable I have not tried all of them for the ones that I've tried they are not powdery at all um I only have like minimal fallouts for like the glitter the gold glitter eyeshadow it's just a few specks of it on my face and um, for the other shades they work perfectly fine they are moderately pigmented some shades are more pigmented than the others I'm really excited to try out the other shades on this palette to create more makeup look Fendi Beauty comes out with like really unique shades they're shades that you feel like you've seen a lot but then they give a little twist to it so good damn good as for the eye primer, I really like it. I've tried it um, yesterday already. It really makes my eyeshadow stays put. But then if you are a beginner going into this, you might want to layer another eyeshadow all over your lids to like set the primer. If you make one mistake, it's going to be harder for you to blend out because the eye, the eye primer, it does what it says it, it just it just grabs onto your eyeshadow I love the eyeliner <laughs> is it offensive to say because I don't think Western makeup brands make um, good eyeliners in general because I'm a big fan of like the Japanese eyeliners a lot of them work for me but not for the Western brands but this from Fenty Beauty it works so well for me it is so pigmented I always need to look for like waterproof and oil proof eyeliner this is one of them not sure if it's waterproof but like I've been like in the rain yesterday so and it stays put so I, I assume that it is as for uh, the lip trios I love the color. I love the names. I have yet to try this one out. I know it can seem like not too wearable, some of these shades. I think if you layer an, a lipstick beneath, like a pink or a beige or a coral, and then go on with these, they would be more wearable. It's just a creative way to try out more colors because it's not like lipstick that it's so solid and bold and with these glosses you can use them as like a topper it won't be like green or blue on your lips so yeah that's um, my review on the summer collection of Fenty Beauty and if you can't tell I am a big fan of the brand I love a lot of the products that they came out with earlier I also got a few of their Mademoiselle lipsticks so if you want to see like lip swatches or review on these lipsticks please let me know in the comments down below also if you have tried any of these out or anything from Fenty Beauty that you like or you don't like please let me know in the comments down below I'm so curious of like what you guys think if you like what you are seeing please give me a thumbs up down below and also if you want to see more of me more of my face please don't hesitate and go and subscribe there will be more videos coming your way okay so it's all cheesy be coming up with more vlogs and beauty videos for you guys and um, I'm just really excited for everything my hair is a mess okay so I'll see you guys next time bye